So here's something you probably don't know. It's a bit of a niche topic. It's about mining. And when we think of mining, we usually think of guys with pickaxes chipping away at a rock face. But the Romans looked at that and went, no thanks. Let's just create and use a high pressure water system instead. And what they built was the ancient world's version of hydraulic mining. To be clear, they didn't invent the general idea of using water in mining. Other ancient cultures used water to wash soil and separate gold. But the Romans took the concept, cranked it up to a scale no one else even attempted and turned turned it into the ancient equivalent of pressure washing. So in modern times, hydraulic mining is fairly simple. You store water, you build up pressure, and you blast it out of rock or soil. And the Romans managed to do the same thing 2000 years ago. The most famous site is in Las Medulas in northwest Spain. If you ever see photos of it, the landscape looks like it's been carved by gods who are in a bad mood. But it was the Romans. They cut kilometers of channels, reservoirs, and tunnels into the mountains, waited until the water built up behind them, and then released it all at once. The force ripped entire sections of the hillside apart and exposed the gold veins beneath. Pliny the Elder wrote about it, saying the noise from the collapse was like thunder trapped inside the earth. The process was called Runa Muntium, the wrecking of mountains, which is possibly the most Roman name you can think of. They weren't gently extracting minerals. They were blowing fucking holes in the landscape using nothing but gravity and engineering. And we know a lot about how they did it as well. Archaeologists have mapped the channels and the reservoirs still exist. You can actually walk through the tunnels yourself. You can literally trace the water system from the mountain peaks all the way down to the collapsed mining pits. It was a masterful civil engineering project on a major scale. And Las Medulas wasn't the only place. There are sites in Wales that show similar systems with leets and tanks feeding water directly onto rock faces to strip them clean. The Romans were fantastic at looking at nature and figure out how to engineer it to their advantage. And you know what? When you think about the Romans casually power washing cliffs off of landscape 2000 years ago, I don't know about you, but I can't help but be impressed.